Hi, sir. It's an Hi. honor. <laughs> um, I heard what you said about the Megatron Starscream dynamic earlier, and I was wondering, uh, what about the Megatron Soundwave Starscream dynamic? Like, how does Soundwave fit in the whole thing? Like, what were you thinking, like, in the movie when he saved Megatron the first time, but didn't when he was being thrown out the airlock? I was just trying to keep the story going and changing it along the way so that the audience could not anticipate what was coming next. Mm. So I always look for things that will surprise the audience, but that they can recognize as fitting. And so it's not like something comes in suddenly and they can't buy it. So it had to be in character, and it had to come at a time when the audience was expecting some other situation to take place. That, that is what you have to do if you're going to keep someone interested. Thank you. You're welcome.